everyone, this is Christine at Stay in Touch. In today's video, I'll be reviewing the task management feature in Rover. The task management feature in Rover will be covered in two parts in our video series. Part one is an overview of how to read the task management page, and part two covers how to assign housekeeping tasks to different team members. Let's get started with part one of today's video, how to read the task management page. After logging into Rover, we begin on the dashboard page. Then we select the sidebar menu icon to reveal the hidden menu. Select housekeeping and then click the task management button. From here, Rover opens the work management page, or as some refer to it as the task management page. This page provides an overview of the current business date's housekeeping activities. But wait, let's take this tutorial from the top. At the top of the page, we are presented with the calendar icon, which auto-loads today's date and provides a quick summary of today's housekeeping activities. However, by clicking the calendar icon, we can choose to select an upcoming date, which allows us to review or manage task assignment for a date in the future. Below the calendar icon, our housekeeping tasks make up the main content on this page. This is a complete list of each housekeeping task that needs to be addressed by the housekeeping staff today. The tasks that appear on this page are completely customizable and can be changed to reflect the language your property uses for housekeeping tasks. In this example, we have five different tasks listed. The first task here, titled Stay Over Clean, is used when a property would like a room cleaned each time the room is occupied by a guest. This room is cleaned each day regardless of when the guest is departing. The Turn Down task indicates a room that needs to be turned down in the evening. Linen Change indicates the room's linens need to be changed and is especially useful for guests who are staying at your property for an extended period of time. Next we have Departure Clean. The housekeeping staff would need to clean the departing guest room so that the room is ready to receive the next guest. And lastly, in this example we are presented with Other. Other can include many miscellaneous cleaning tasks your property may wish to have pre-configured, so they display here as well. In this example, clicking the chevron arrows reveal the minibar housekeeping tasks, which tells the housekeeping staff member to restock the minibar. To the right of each task, Rover presents the user with some details about the task, which assists the user with getting an overall sense for the day's housekeeping activities. As you can see from our other example, clicking the orange chevron arrows in Rover will reveal subtasks for each housekeeping task. Beside these arrows, there is a total hours column. As you can see for each task, Rover calculates the amount of time it will take to complete a task based on the total number of rooms that need to be cleaned that day, which displays in the column to the right. Then we have the assigned column and the completed column. Based on the number of rooms listed in the total rooms column, the number of these rooms that have been assigned will display here. As rooms are assigned to housekeepers, this number will increase or decrease. We will go into more detail about task assignment in part two of this video. And for the completed column, this column represents tasks as they are updated with a completed status in Rover. A red number that displays under the completed column in Rover indicates to the user that a task has been assigned but has not yet been completed. Lastly, we included a reset button in the top right hand corner of the page in cases where a user would like to be able to refresh the page to ensure the numbers that display in the completed column are as up to date as possible. And that's a basic overview of how to read the work management page. Now to navigate to the actual task management section, we will need to select the blue Manage Worksheets button. I cover this feature and how to manage task assignment in part two of this video. Please reach out to a member of our support team if you have questions or check out the articles in our knowledge base. Thank you.